it's night and I got back from London the flight took like a really long time I'm gonna just get my essentials from here and pack just slightly I hope these survived the ride I kind of squished my suitcase okay they're so good With my friends, we did a personality test because we were like, are we compatible as friends? And I knew that I was ENFP, right? And that came out of a score. So what I realized in London, you know, I live with people, they have quite some friends and it's like a busy city. So I thought that was like the last thing I need because I'm introvert and I need my peace. I need my alone time. Um, turns out it's what I need because I've been home for 12 hours and I like I just wake up and I'm thinking about stuff and I'm talking to myself and I'm rambling and I'm overthinking already fucking everything which I did not do a single second in London. Okay we're back to planning and I'm gonna be on my laptop all day because it's sad weather. I'm glad to be home. Good morning. 
it's Friday. I had a very nice week. Very productive. Last week, I had like the worst week ever. And I'm starting to realize some things. It's a nice sunny day. I feel like I would want to live on my own at some point. And right now it's just not really very realistic that I'm gonna live on my own anytime soon, but I am getting rid of some belongings. Wat zit jij daar te doen hier? Wat te doen? Een geschat. You did not pick out an outfit anymore last night and I have to leave in half an hour. And I have to eat and stuff. What do you wear in Amsterdam? It's gonna be pretty nice weather those.
recently I'm trying to find like a hairstyle for when my hair is slightly greasy. So I've been loving little braids, but these are little pigtails and I'm also like, it's kind of fun. I like the fit. I decided to vlog today. I am still applying for a lot of jobs. I had only one interview and during that interview, I was like, why am I here? Because he invited me and I thought I would match. During the conversation, it just turned into this thing and I was like, why did you invite me? You're not looking for me. Like I, he asked me some questions and I was like, yeah, I think I can do that. He really needed someone experienced. And I was like, you know I'm not experienced in this because you saw my resume. It's never a waste of time. And I, I still work um, the part-time job in the village because I don't know how to get out of it. It's like, it's my only income right now. No, it's not my only income, but it is my definitely my main income right now which is why i keep working there because it's 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 a fine job like, like i get so fucking excited every time i need to do something content creator related i had a shoot with my friend she was going to shoot for a dutch band she invited me to be assistant just helping her like set up the camera and i'm like doing some assistant things and i I fucking love this shit and um, I got so excited from this and that this is my week and I'm sending out, I'm selling clothes and I'm getting rid of things in my room and why is this kind of crooked? I've been so creative on so many levels and I, like there's so many creative outlets right now and every single day I feel so fulfilled that nothing else matters. It's just, it's like, I feel so great doing this. But like, I need someone here and I, I fucking don't know how to do this. <sighs> Anyways. It's almost five o'clock by the way. And I was gonna make some pictures for selling my clothes. I think I'm gonna get rid of this jacket. I actually kinda like this right now. I'm gonna give it a go. I posted some items on Vintage. You can check them out too. And then I'm gonna work on my laptop the rest of the day because I'm starting to get a migraine. My mom is making a soup, so that's the first thing I'm going to do and I'm going to sit on my laptop. The rest of my room is a mess, but we'll get there, we'll get there. <laughs> yep. Thank you.